Welcome to the case-based approach, Deep Brain Stimulation course, the CBA DBS, a full online course on how to program DBS in our patients with Parkinson's disease, dystonia, and tremor. My name is Rubens Cury, I'm a neurologist, movement disorders, and DBS specialist. And I built this course in order to teach you exactly how you're going to manage your patients with DBS and movement disorders. So what am I going to cover in this course? Basically, from the beginning, what are the clinical indications of the DBS and movement disorders for Parkinson's, dystonia, and tremor? The clinical outcomes that you are going to expect after the surgery. And the second part, I'm going to teach you how to do the intraoperative tests, the clinical tests, the micro-recording from the neurologist perspective. In the third session, I'm going to teach you how to reconstruct the imaging because today is very difficult. You program your patients in a blind way. You need to see the electrode. I'm going to teach you how to reconstruct using the steam view from Boston, from Brain Lab, and the lead DBS software. There is a specific session only to teach you step-by-step step how to reconstruct the imaging. And then I'm going to start the main focus of this course that's the program, the initial program of the DBS, the first appointment after the surgery, and then all the advanced program in the whole trajectory of the patient over the years, how to manage speech problems, gait problems, dyskinesia, and so forth. It's a complete course of DBS in movement disorders where our focus mainly on Parkinson's disease. That's the idea. So how does the course work? Basically, when you get the course, you're going to have immediately all the online classes that I have recorded. And you can see how many times you want. You can see it again, and then you can take notes. There is space in the Hotmart platform where you can text your doubts, your questions, and then I can answer directly to you. If many students have a specific doubt, I can record a new class to cover that issue, that problem. And periodically, I'm going to feed all the platform with new information, new classes. So this is a full online with many, many informations about DBS program. But I'm going to put new information every time that a new platform, for example, is launched or a new software or a new case that I'm going to see in my clinical practice, I'm going to put new information over time in the platform. You have 12 months the access of the classes and you can resign again if you wish after the time the 12 months and for whom is this course basically for neurologists neurosurgeons other professionals involved in the field of dbs fellows residents and so forth and this course i'm going to cover the basics of dbs if you are a beginner, if you don't know how to start the DBS program, I'm going to teach you exactly from scratch how to do it. But if you are used to apply DBS in your patients and your program, I'm going to explain you how you can refine the most advanced programs of DBS I'm going to cover this course. So basically for those who do not use DBS or for those who already use but want to improve their skills, this course is aimed for. And what was my motivation doing this course? Basically, over the last years, I have been seeing many, many patients with Parkinson's and DBS and patients with dystonia and sexual tremor. And then I decided to put all that information together in this course. Many, many cases, real cases. I think that the best way to learn DBS is to see cases. How I do my, my routine, how you can start a program to see the imaging. And then I have the chance in this course to show you many videos, many images, and can, I'm going to show you how you can program with the Boston, Medtronic, and Abbott platforms and programmers. And then I, I think that was the best way to pass this information forward. Throughout this landing page, you can find other information about the course. There is an email where you can text your questions, your doubts, then I can help you. And I hope to see in this course, I'm sure that you are going to be more confident in seeing your patients, you'll, be, you'll refine your skills, 
and consequently you are going to help more your patients okay so see you then